I'm not gonna do the video of this on my head. <laughs> Spending time with great focus. To quote Bruce Lee, to spend time is to pass it in a specified manner. To waste time is to expend it thoughtlessly or carelessly. We all have time to either spend or waste, and it is our decision what to do with it. But once passed, it is gone forever. Let's talk about focus. Let's talk about how a day works. We have 24 hours in a given day, right? The Earth spins. Let's represent it as this set of time we have, okay? People sleep a third. Let's say eight hours, maybe eight to nine if you're feeling ambitious. Question one, 24 hours in the day, sleep eight to nine. Why not sleep four? And then you can be up for 20. That's because you'll feel terrible. You won't be able to focus. You won't be able to engage directly with what's going on. It'll feel kind of like a muddy, groggy, almost sleep drunken experience. Sleep is important. You want to spend time effectively. You want to think creatively and critically, get your sleep. The rest, whatever, do what you have to. This is your field of vision. This is your fovea. This is the high resolution point of your vision. Think about you're reading the words on a page. You don't just zoom out and read the whole page. Speed reading is a myth. It's not real. Look it up. They don't actually read those books. You have the words on a page you need to scan with your fovea. Similarly, you have your day that's in front of you. You need to focus on one thing at a time. You can't just say, this is all the stuff I need to do. I'm gonna have octopus legs and do everything all at once. No, one thing at a time. Understand precisely what you're working on at a given time. What's the first thing you should do in a day? Just be. Listen, breathe, experience, be thankful that you're alive, and then have breakfast. Breakfast is important. Why is breakfast important? It's because the brain, what's up brain? 20% daily calorie intake. It goes to your brain. Isn't that expensive? Wow. But we're humans, we're smart. You would expect a big computer to be pretty expensive. Eat your breakfast. Get your energy for your brain. Moving forward from your breakfast, you would say, what is my first task? What is the most important thing that I'm trying to get done today? Put that before you. Understand what that thing is. Understand the things that want to kind of edge in and distract you, like checking your emails. Sweep it to the side. What is this, Reddit tabs? We'll get to that later. I'll just put you over here. Reddit's pretty cool. You don't want to have a bunch of different things that are all eating a piece of your most precise focus at a given time. You want to have one thing, and you want to focus on that as hard as you possibly can to get things done. It's amazing. Let's think about maintaining focus throughout the day. You're focused, right? Think about your focus as holding up a stack of books. It's not that hard. You have muscles in your arm. It's only three books. You're fine. Think about holding this for seven hours. Your arm will hurt. You will hate your life in a very deep and profound way. You should put the book down at least once every like hour or two hours or something. Take breaks. Understand when your focus is starting to slip, when you're kind of getting a little bit more distracted. Take a break, take a breather. Do a stretch, do a yoga, whatever you have to. Do some push-ups and pull-ups. It's good to take breaks. It's good to engage your body and say, all right, I know my brain and my focus, they're trying to do this thing, but I'm getting tired. So I'm gonna take a quick break, regather my efforts, and then hit it again with my most precise center focus. Let's say breakfast is this first line in your tree of the day. What's your next item in your day? Do you have other things going on? Sometimes people need to, let's say, drive to work. What happens when they drive to work and they're texting on a cell phone and they're listening to music and they're doing their makeup and there's a little dog like hopping on their lap and stuff, they crash. It's terrible. Don't do this. Think about having one thing. Just, just drive. Just drive to work. You can have the music. Listen to music and drive to work. You'll still be pretty focused. Be aware when there are two different things that are occupying your attention at a given time. Say you're at the computer. If you have three tabs open, you're tabbing between things, the internet's amazing. You're also trying to write a paper. Ugh. Ah. You're also watching a stream. Streams are amazing. Follow my stream if you want to. <laughs> Your focus on any of these individual things will be very weak. You can think about the time efficiency of what you're trying to do. What do you have? Two hours for this window? Why not say, I'm gonna relegate my browsing and my streaming to one hour. Let's say, remove this. Remove this paper writing procedure. For the next hour, I will only do this. You'll be going a lot faster. If 
the entirety of your focus is directed toward one thing. This time is great. Take this time for yourself. Enjoy the internet, learning, experiencing, sharing time with other people, but you gotta get shit done too. To recap, time is sacred. It's money, it's experience. We have it to spend or to waste. Spend it thoughtfully with a deliberate intention of what you're trying to get done. Because once it's gone, so are you. We don't live forever. 24 hours in the day, get your sleep. Attention, that's amazing. Focus, that's a smaller thing. Understand what's in the center of your focus at a given time. Brain, you need this. Food, survive. Diagrams, whatever. <laughs> Shout out to Subilal for making this video possible. He's in medical school, training to become a doctor to save your life. In life or death scenarios, you want to make sure your doctor had their sleep, understands how to focus, and is focused on keeping you alive and not these things. You might as well believe your own bullshit. <laughs> to recap, Bruce Lee, he died too early. It's a bummer. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? You're already doing that part.